Good morning guys, it's a new day, a new vlog and um, I'm actually starting to record a little bit late today because this morning I went to the Cancer Walk 2024 well actually I just went to the finish line um, I went with Ash to take some pictures of that so you could see that in my previous vlog from yesterday um, but it's a new day so we're on to new things so um, yeah we're outside Let's see what these two are up to. Good job. <laughs> yeah, mom, you can't catch it. Huh? You can't catch it. I can't? I could see if I should catch this thing. Oh. <laughs> try again, try again. Um, nope. Watch me catch my first shot. Did it? All right. Wow! <laughs> oh, poop. Mm -hmm. Hey guys, so we're out and about, and we stunting. <laughs> we eating pizza. Yeah, we came to get a little bit of pizza. Are you? Do you like pizza? Yeah. Oh yeah. So you're gonna eat a slice. How many slices are you gonna eat? One. One slice? Yeah. Okay. Pizza! Pizza. See you pizza? Pizza, pizza. Oh, look over there. What's here? I don't even fear that day. Like, why do you have to be so night? I have no idea. They want Next their time, colors look pretty. Let's go to the fair. Yeah. Go. Alright guys, so I'm finally back home and right now I want to talk about my song called Be Kind. If you haven't heard it yet, you guys should definitely go check it out. I already have a music video out for it as well. So you can find the lyrics on video or you can watch the music video or you can watch both. Why not? <laughs> right, so today I'm going to be talking about Be Kind. Um, this song it's definitely one of my favorite off of the albums which is why I, I did a music video for it um and i just really really like the message so i'm gonna be going through the lyrics and talking about that right now and i have my trusty handy dandy tablet to play the music so let's go all right so pretty much honestly the first line is pretty self-explanatory um every time i take a walk on the street i feel bad for the people i meet because literally you'll go out and you meet all kind of people and there's always a lot of people coming up to you um asking you for something and so the next line says beg a dollar or two pan repeat because people like i don't know but in Belize, a lot of times when you go to like a shop or somewhere, there's always people outside asking for a dollar or two now because inflation. People not ask for dollar no more. Dollar not really help. But there's always people out there, a lot of beggars, a lot of poor people who need something. And I think that what common thing in Belize, I don't know elsewhere, but for sure here, a lot of times we like think about it like really hard if we should give people the money because we worry about what they're gonna do with it right um so i still think twice if that at them i need like you know you think about it like should hmm. because a lot of times to so the people who really need the money but also there's a lot of drug addicts around and stuff and so you think about that like 
I wonder if I should give them this dollar because I wonder if that they really need or if they just to try you know catch the next high like you know so that it, it's a it's a really really sad situation but that's the reality out here you know but I want to respect to them people everybody defies the moon demons but I believe that there's a reason everybody got the time and their season but I want to show respect to them people everybody they fight their own demons right so it no matter what at the end of the day i'm saying that it doesn't matter what their people like what i think about their people you know what i think you know i wonder if that drug if that just drugs they want you like it shouldn't even be about that everybody deserves respect and i think a lot of time like that is something i noticed to a lot of people end up disrespecting their people just because they live on the street or just because they look poor or just because maybe they're dirty and you know they need help and stuff then they're out there you know and a lot of people end up disrespecting their people just because of where they are and and so i'm just saying you know no matter what though even though sometimes you think about it we should always show respect to them right because the next line says everybody they fight them one demons they have problems just like you and i we all they try fight you know this life we all they tr just to try we all need help we all you know what else they might just need a dollar or two me and you need help in some kind of way as well and so we should always show respect to them the same way that we would want people to show respect to us the same way when we need it as well right but i believe that there's a reason everybody got their time and their season right um so i'm just saying you know i believe that there's a reason you know there's always a reason why they in the place that they are why why we in the place that we are and why then they go through when they go through and why we might end up they go through where we go through because you never know what could happen to you tomorrow or later on in the day you know so that's why it's important for you to respect people because you never know because the next the last line says everybody got their time and their season you never know when it could be you out there asking for a dollar or two you know right so it say i know better than them I know they're no better than me. Anyone now we can rise up and out and know we drop for we need. Literally, you know better than them and they're no better than you. We are all out here trying, right? And the same way that you may feel like you above these people sometimes or certain people, you might feel like you above certain people. Any single one of us could rise up and out and know we drop on your knee. And I mean that in a what, hypothetical way and a literal way because hypothetically it's just the, the, the action of falling, you know, people climb the ladder like they say and then when you get to the top and you fall, that was hard fall, right? So you drop on your knee in a in a way like it's a metaphor. But also in like the most literal way because a lot of times when we fall that then we end up on our knee to pray, you know, because now we don't have no other options and so it could happen to anybody anyone that we could rise up and out of no way you could end up in the same position where there are people where you the look down upon the inner and that's why it's important too right that's why it's important for us to all be kind to one another be kind and share love with each other i feel like these lines are so self-explanatory help each other when you see we drop down when you see a brother has fallen when you see you know people out here the struggle you know just be kind right and then um help the man when it's a big out of town because literally i know that we double think it a lot and i know that there's so much conclusions where you could draw about no but i don't think here i use the money for good and stuff but at the end of the day 
you should still be kind because you never actually truly truly know maybe they do have a drug problem yes but also maybe they are actually hungry too because even they need to eat sometimes you know and you just never truly know Help all you can in a day of hard times. No need to give much, just a little of your time. We are living in hard times. We are. And all of us have our own problems, you know, our own way. Some people problems may seem bigger than some, but at the end of the day, we are all going through it. We are all just trying to survive out here. And it is hard times. I feel like the economy is hard. There's so many things that just get ridiculous since back in the day. You know, we always hear people complaining about the cost of living is so high. These are absolutely hard times we are living in. And sometimes it's not even about giving financially. It's about simply being kind enough to respect these people because a lot of times these people don't get respect from nobody and everybody's showing a bad face so even if they're like well he smile you know even if they just to say good morning to sup today you know show them respect treat them like human beings you know because it could be any one of us in another situation and when it's you trust me you will want dali you will want people to respect you the same way and i could tell you one smile could brighten up people's day and so i always try make it a thing for like smile with everybody i always try share a smile especially when i see somebody face makeup and i know sometimes you'll get backs right but especially when i see somebody face makeup i very intentionally will smile with you and say hi because one smile and i see it all the time like when i smile with people they always end up smile back that big face change really fast and i have experienced it too where i in my own world and somebody be kind to me and that just kind of lighten your mood you know so no need to give much just a little of your time a lot of people just need a listening ear sometimes they just need a hug sometimes you know some people just need a hug some people just need some kind of assurance that they still work something and then they're just trash you know like be kind to people When you think about the things you go through, remember some have it better than you. Some of them not even have one shoe. At least you could take care with crazy clues. When you think about the things you go through, remember some have it better than you. Honestly, I feel like this happens to a lot of us. I feel like we get caught up in our own life, our own worries, our own situations. And then we forget that some people have it worse than you. Sometimes we feel like only we to go through it. We feel like, well, I don't know that, so I me can go, right? But it doesn't take a lot, right? And um, it's just important to remember that when you think you have it bad, some people really do have it better than you. Some of them not even have one shoes. At least you could stick yours with crazy glue. Right? And honestly, that's my favorite, favorite line because I feel like it's so real. We complain sometimes about the fact that shucks, I can't get a new shoes right now because I don't have enough money. I brought, I can't, I can't, oh man, life hard, life suck. I can't even afford a new shoes right now. But at least you have one. Right? Even if that is that the one where you stay to wear for years and years where you have to keep the stick back with crazy glue. You should be grateful that you even have one. Some people don't even have one, right? So why was your respect to them people? Everybody defy the moon demons, but I believe that there's a reason. Everybody got their time and their season. I know better than them. I know they know better than me. Anyone that we can rise to. I know I know we drop on me. So I know that we can love with each other. Help each other when you see we drop on. Be kind. So I know that we can love with each other. Help all your family. 
I think I had times No need to give much, just a little of like your time So the message for today is to be kind. You know, whatever you're doing in your day today, make sure you go out and you make an effort to be kind to someone today. Be kind to everybody. Because truly you never know. And 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 like I could link this right back to the first son that I was talking about, human. You never know what people they go through, you know. Sometimes people they go through so much and you might think like I'll kinda think about these people, but you truly, truly never know and it could just one day be you and i have experienced this i feel like this song really meant so much to me because it's something that i have lived and come to realize and i've lived through that i've been there where anyone that we can rise up and out and know we drop how we need literally guys i have been there you know when i get sick i don't think nobody missed it at the call right because i was so like active up going everybody always made a say like oh marlin you know great things to come for you nobody could have seen that i would have been the one to fall you know to to drop on my knees in a way you know and i realized when i got sick how much people were kind to me like and and i know that people have supported my music from you know day one i know that i have people who love me care about me support my music and me and stuff but still when you end up in that situation and that not about your music now it's not about your position or who you are or what you do it's not about any of that when sickness hit or when or when any kind of tragedy hit or you know the downfall of anything you know like none of that your position power none of that no matter like they say all of it going the same way in the ground one day right it no matter who you are or what kind of per like you know it no matter about none of that so although i know that people have ge have like genuinely been supporting me and loved me and stuff the outpour of kindness from people all over belize all over the world you know the, the outpour of that may still like hit me so hard i just realized that i needed to be kinder as well because i know like i always thought that i was a kind person but when i saw how kind genuinely kind people were that just made me reflect on myself and you know like realize that i need to do better and be better treat people better treat people the way that you know people have been treating me in at this hard time in my life you know when people they go through their hard times because you never know who how many of them people on the street stories haven't we heard about where here oh you said a monday he used to work that such and such and he had high position but then so and so happened and now this the way he end up it could be any one of us nobody life off limits you know and so it's so important for us to be kind and show love share love with each other <laughs> all right guys it's night time now and guess where we're going <laughs> are you ready yeah are you excited Who's here? Who's here? Baby. What's her name? Ellie. Oh, it's Ellie. Hi, Ellie. Is Ellie going to the fair too? Yeah. Ooh. And look, guys, this shirt is very on team for what I was talking about today. Be kind <laughs> to one another. <laughs>
Mama, you are in a crazy chair. Are you excited? which is an MS symptom that I have been struggling with um, for a while actually but that's a story for another time um, but yeah I was feeling way too sick to continue shooting so as I got home I pretty much just had to try to get to bed um, quickly so that's what I did um, after sleeping though this morning I am feeling better um, but my body is still really really weak so these are like the prices you have to pay to have a nice time like literally that's just life with MS and every single time I end up paying the price for it but you know what it was really really worth it because I had such a nice time on the crazy chair um, while being on it it felt amazing and um, so much fun and I I know my daughter enjoyed her night and that was the main thing for me like I just wanted to make sure she enjoyed her night and so um, she definitely did it and I did too um, I wanted to write up something <laughs> and I did so um, I enjoyed the moment and then after that now I'm paying for it <laughs> but that's okay um, I think I just need to rest so I'm gonna be taking um, the rest of the day off so that I could try to feel better um, so I know it's a new day but it's not gonna be a new vlog today so um, you won't be seeing any new vlogs until I think Tuesday. Um, I'm gonna take the day off, so um, just make sure you hit the notification bell so you can see when I post next. Stay tuned, <laughs> and don't forget, guys, to be kind, show love, and I'll see you tomorrow. Well, not tomorrow, the next day. <laughs> Bye.
a dollar or two plan we keep I see you think twice ever that them I need But I want show respect to them people Everybody defy them own demons But I believe that there's a reason Everybody got their time and their season Drop out with me, guys. Don't want another me, guys. Share love with each other. Help each other when you see we drop down. Help the man when it did back go that door. Be guys. Don't want another me, guys. Share love with each other. Help all your can in a day of hard times. No need to give much, just a little of like your time. So I want your respect to them people. 